What's going on you guys? It's Andrew from Posh Designs and today is episode 32 of my weekly series called GFX Tip Friday where I go into Photoshop, After Effects, Cinema 4D or another demanding editing program and I show you guys one tip that can be used in everyday editing. And today's episode actually comes from one of you subscribers who wants to know how to turn a really clean picture into kind of a grainy look, um, almost like an old look uh, that would have came from a time um, before obviously digital cameras. So what, all we need to do is we just need to go on to the internet, look up a grainy texture, and then we're gonna mess with the curves a little bit and overlay it um, onto a digital picture. So guys, without further ado, let's hop right on in it. So what I did is I just went on the internet and I found a grainy texture that looks someone somewhat like this. Also, we have this one, which this is the one that I will actually be playing around with. I'll actually uh, throw that in the description below so you guys can definitely go check that out. But let's just drag this on into Photoshop and hold down shift to maintain aspect ratio and we're just going to reach the corners with this like so and just hit enter and all you have to do is just go to normal go to overlay and now that's going to overlay it on to your photo now obviously this gives a really nice grainy look um, that you know obviously looks like it was from a time before digital photos but all we have to do is come down here to our attributes and go to curves and we can actually mess with the curves um, then to make it either lighter and we could add you know a little darkness to it to you know kind of mess around with the contrast and make it however you guys please so I'm gonna make mine right about there that looks about good and then now you guys have a kind of grainy look so it's actually really simple guys um, not a really hard um, thing to recreate but definitely um, finding a nice grainy texture is going to be um, kind of a really hit and miss so uh, play around with grainy textures kind of play around with concrete textures as well concrete textures add a really nice cool effect um, to photos so you guys can do that exact same way just use a concrete texture um, and yeah guys so I hope this tip helped you guys out really quick video um, and I hope you guys enjoyed so if you guys did enjoy this video or it did help you out please hit that thumbs up button go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you guys are not already subscribed and thanks for watching guys have a great weekend and I'll talk to you guys later bye My thoughts keep telling me to get me home, but my balls keep telling me to let me oh, oh, just let me oh. That clock keeps ticking like a metronome, and my thoughts keep telling me to get me home, but my balls keep telling me to let me oh, oh, just let me oh. That clock keeps ticking like a metronome, and my thoughts keep telling me to get me home, but my balls keep telling me to let me oh. Fuck all that shit, just let me go. Owners and tastemakers make us no chaser. Gets the blood flowing like a fucking pacemaker. Cut the middle.